Hi everyone, I just want to say thank you so much for watching my video. If you want the full recipe, uh, you can find that below or you can click this bowl right here. So first off, I don't say this isn't my original idea. I came upon this dish when I was checking a website where they were promoting this breakfast udon. Um, the place was called Koya Bar and is, they're located in London and it got pretty uh, popular because of their English breakfast, uh, English, ah, well, because of their English breakfast udon. I thought it was really cool, so I decided to make my own version of it. Um, I mean, it's actually really simple. You just boil a bunch of ingredients, fry it, and then fry an egg and bacon. The only thing that is a little difficult is the homemade dashi, which, you know, you can actually don't even need to. You can actually buy just the pre-made, like, instant soup mix uh, at Asian markets. The only reason that I made this video is because I thought it would be really cool to take pictures of it and just that uh, I wanted, I had an idea where I would grab a burrito, deconstruct it, and then using uh, camera magic, I would change it into the ingredients for the recipe. There was a couple of issues though when I was filming, and that was that I didn't have a shutter timer, uh, which was where how you would actually film stop motion, where you would set the camera to take pictures every couple of seconds, and then you would usually the photos would come out quite clean. The issue is I didn't have one, so what I did was I filmed regularly, and then I put it into After Effects, and then I changed the footage to play every couple of frames. I think maybe like four frames or something, and that's what created the um, the stop motion feel. The only problem that I don't like about it is that it created a lot of blurring because so like when I quickly grabbed something, it blurred in the cl the frame, and I couldn't get rid of it because if I I tried getting rid of all the blurred frames and it just missing a lot of footage. It's like one hand there and suddenly it just like teleported with a leaf in it in the other hand. I had a lot of fun editing this actually, you know, making the f the beginning really dull, then using the stop motion to change the recipe, and then the rest of it was as usual. Oh, all right. And that's it. If you want to see my upcoming videos, you can subscribe. Uh, if you want to see more of my other videos, it's right up there. And if, as usual, if you want to help this channel grow, subscribe, like, thumbs up, share, all that stuff. And finally, any comments, suggestions, recipe ideas, or you want to just chat, leave them down below, and I'll check them out. Cheers.